Hi guys, welcome back to our short videos on business studies. And today we're going to look at a new uh, chapter called market research in the unit of marketing. So let's move on. Now, let's look at what market research means. Okay, so there's a definition here for you. It is the process of collecting, recording, and analyzing information about customers, competitors, and the market. So it's pretty easy to remember. It's looking about collecting information, recording information, analyzing information about who, customers, competitors, and the market. All right. So why do we do market research? What are the benefits of market research, right? So when you do market research, you're able to identify different customers, different market characteristics, and what people like and don't, and don't like. That, that is what you can gather from doing market research. At the same time, you can also find out about the trends, right? And how competitors are doing. And it's not only important for new businesses to get into market research, it's also crucial for existing businesses so that they can keep themselves updated of what's happening around them and how to change, you know, in terms of uh, the products and services that they have to cater to their customers' needs, right? Thirdly, it's also about market segmentation. Businesses do market research to identify their customers, the markets, and how to cater to different products and services from different markets. So market research is also involved in market segmentation. Now, let's look at the benefits as well as the limitations of conducting market research. Of course, when you do look at the benefits, it is reducing the risk of a business because you are preparing or planning ahead to identify your customers, your competitors, the market, right? So this reduces your risk of failure or producing something that nobody wants, right? And um, potentially minimizing the risk of uh, uh, loss, right? Secondly, it is about predicting changes. Market research help a business identify what could possibly happen depending on how the competitors are behaving, how people are changing the way they purchase things, right? Uh, and these are all possible with the help of market research. It's also about understanding patterns and trends, spending patterns and trends, right? So by conducting market research, you are able to find out what are people spending more money on, right? That helps you decide whether you want to produce a similar product or improve on the development of a similar product, right? And also about the various fashion trends that is available. At the same time, when you do a market research, you're also checking again right, or assessing again the effectiveness of your own marketing plan before you decide to market produce a particular product to see whether it's really going to be a good plan for you to go ahead. So those are some of the benefits of market research. At the same time, you've got to look at the limitations. So the word market research tells you that it's not going to be something very fast, right? It is a bit tedious. It can be time consuming and it's also possibly costly because most of the time companies may engage uh, consultants or third-party companies to help them conduct this market research and tell them what to do right so this could be costly and sometimes if, it, if you don't have much money to do market research you may engage anyone possible and that may not be accurate because that person may not have the right experience to give you the right data or information about the market the customers and also the competitors okay and thirdly, again, market research is a planning or a forecast, right, about what could possibly happen. Again, when we go back to the benefit, is predicting changes, right? So prediction may not be necessarily true, right, because there could be factors that may affect um, the your plan, your most effective marketing plan, right, even though you've done a thorough market research and that may not be covered by it. And that's that's how um, your business may still see a bit of a failure or may not be may not be going as planned simply because it is affected by unexpected changes in the market or the economy, all right, and things like that. So there you go. We've spoken about the benefits and limitations of market research. Now, 
this is a place where you have to test yourself and prepare your answers in, at your own pace, at your own time. And let's look at some of the questions that you will have to do. You've got to define what market research means. So we spoke about collecting, analyzing information about customers, competitors in the market, right? So that is essentially the definition. So you've got to make sure that you remember and you understand. Secondly, explain two benefits to a business of conducting a market research. Why would businesses do market research? How will it benefit them? Okay. Thirdly, what is the limitations or explain two limitations of conducting a market research? Fourthly, how can market research improve the effectiveness of business decisions? Right? How can a market research really improve the effectiveness which means if a business does market research then their business decisions would be very effective would be better right how can the market research do that right fifth question why is it important for a business to know about its customers in other words why is market research used right why is it so important to know about a, a business customers so what, what do they do what is the part of the benefit to know this right so these are the five questions um revision questions i call it for you to prepare on this short chapter or short explanation on market research okay so i don't need to say much here because you know that we have come to the end of today's class uh, i thank you for watching this far and uh, i hope that you know you're benefiting and gaining from this and if you do please share with your friends like subscribe and until we meet again in the next video have a pleasant pleasant day ahead